Hey, what's up everybody? 420 Guitar coming to you with another video. This is a Fortnite video and this is talking about the new limited time mode um, that was announced for the Game Awards at 7. It is a 50 versus 50 mode and it is for a limited time. Um, it says, we've been teasing you about the mode all week. The time has come. Starting now, you can hop into your first, into our first limited time mode, 50 versus 50. Team battles in and out, most epic battle action yet. Okay, how long? The 50v50 playlist is available from December 8th to through December 17th. So make sure to grab your friends, jump into the battle for a limited time. How does it work? Just load up the Battle Royale, select 50 versus 50 playlist. You can jump to the mode solo or up to three friends. Once the battle bus gets flying, you'll see your squad on the map and communicate like normal squad or duo match. You'll also see green markers on the map and above the heads of the remaining 50 player team. The circle closes in, the last team standing wins. Are there any special rules? Friendly fire is off. Squad VOIP only. You will have limited visibility of your teammates until you land. The friendly teammates, you can revive any friendly teammate. Um, this week, well, we revealed our limited time 50 versus 50 mode, and you can play right now. Grab your closest friends, jump into the epic battle. The last team standing wins. Also, a snowball weapon is coming soon. Snowball weapon. These snowballs are exploding, are for exploding. Spread holiday cheer by toppling your enemy's stronghold next week. So I'm guessing next week they're going to have the update. New snowballs, probably going to be snow, Christmas trees, snowmen, all that good stuff. Um, so when you jump into your game, go ahead and select Battle Royale. And if you can see, there's actually going to be um, down by match type. Solo squad 50 versus 50. Uh, just choose your 50 versus 50. So if you were looking for it somewhere else, it's actually going to be right here. Um, in the match type menu. So when you choose your 50 versus 50, go ahead and jump in. <clears throat> once you are in, you're going to be, once you're in the bus and you jump out of your bus, you're gonna be jumping out with a team of four. You will be part of a team of four. Um, you are part of a team of 50, uh, but you are in squads of four. So as you can see on the map, I can see my four squad mates, but I cannot see any of my other teammates. Um, that will change once we do get on the ground. And try to land with your teammates if possible. Again, you don't know where they're going. There's 50 people, so they're going to randomly go, be going random places. Um, if you can stick with your squad, that's great. Um, if not, it's okay because you will be able to run into your teammates all over the map, which is pretty cool. Um, it's really nice. It's really cool. It's really fun, actually. And... Um, yeah, anyway, so when you get close to somebody, after you've gotten all your stuff, if you're looking for your teammates, they're actually going to be popping up on your map. So it did say you wouldn't be able to see them until you land. So when you do land, and when you're close enough, you can see on the screen there's going to be green markers. And those are going to be the teammates within your vicinity. I'm not sure how close the vicinity is. It might be a few hundred meters, I'm guessing like 300 meters maybe maybe 250 meters, something like that, um, 400 meters possibly. I'm not sure what the distance is. I'll have to look it up. But as soon as you get close enough, you will be able to see them on your mini map as well. So that's going to be able to help you to be able to get to your teammate and possibly survive or help them out if they are in danger. Um, you will actually be able to help each other out a lot. It's, it's really cool how they have that where you can actually see your teammates. Um, it's good for the uh, team aspect of it. So. That's definitely great. So the storm is going to be normal. Uh, do stay inside the circle. Keep pushing forward to your circle. Stay out of the storm. It is going to close in. And I think it closes in normally. <clears throat> I'm not sure as far as the power, as far as how many people are left, how much power it takes from you. I know it, in the other modes, it'll take like one, and then it'll take two, and then it'll take like 15 or whatever, depending on how many people are left or how small the circle is, whatever. Um, so yeah, keep that in mind uh, for the storm. And so once you're able to meet up with the squad, if you take a look at the mini map, you can see all of my squad, there's a crap ton of people. We were losing earlier uh, by 15 kills. I think it was like 30 to 32 to like 23 or something, 20. And uh, we came all the way back, 12 to six. Um, when you make it to your teammates, it's good to go ahead and set up shop. 
set your fortress up, whatever, make sure that you guys are together. Um, the more you are together, the better chance you had to win. Uh, this is my first 50 versus 50, so you have to get in there and kill people quick. If you don't get the kills quick, there's only 50 people. Somebody else is going to get all the kills. So anyway, there you go, guys. This is just a quick video on the new 50 versus 50 mode, and it is out from December 8th until December 17th. So go ahead and check it out. And don't forget, you can check your stats after all the games. And as you can see, I didn't get any kills because, again, you have to hurry up. Make sure that you get those kills early or you might miss out, guys. Anyway, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. I hope this helps. And we'll see you in the next video. Peace.